Alright. Super, super 10 dollars went out of business. Oh, man, it's gonna be a whole next recording. So I might look at my rent recording. You can send me this because then people ask me and be like, Can we get out my tape? <laughs> <laughs> Handle business cards. Right? Uh, I said the revolution will be televised. Yep. Panasonic and Bruce Afrom. Panasonic and Bruce Afrom. I still say the revolution is redundant. Basically, the entire video game industry is redundant. How is it redundant? What was the last greatest game that you could think that everyone's all hyping over? You can't say Halo because Halo 2 is just music games know, are its own genre in here. But like, you know, Grand Theft Auto was a great game. Came out with, when did that come out? 2001? When I was in high school? Yeah. And right. It was now, we now we hear, oh, Grand Theft Auto, San Andreas, nothing Stop changed. smoking. Yeah, it looks better. But games are even fighting games. Quit that they're game. all the same thing. Yeah, Basically, kept on too. the video game industry has died. Has died in the 80s with the Atari. Atari killed it. The Commodore, 32, and the Atari. Atari was great. Which one? There's only one. Bull, Atari 52. The other ones don't count. They didn't exist. Like the GameCube, the way it's designed, it's awesome. Like, I'm looking at the Xbox. Yes, it's a bigger disc, but they suck space. They use WAV files for everything. WMVs. It's a shitty computer. Yes, WAV. The soundtrack list to my freaking Phantom Crash is two gigs. It's like one hour. No. It, it just kills. Like, ooh, like four gigs. Like, you're wasting it. Might as well put a record player in there. I'm like, next generation, we'll be like, well, if I want to hook up my sound system with my media center, I'm going to get an Xbox. But if I want a PC that can burn DVDs and connect to my PSP, I want a PSP. If I want something new to play, because everything else is generic, I'm going to get myself a revolution. GameCube games are going to be 30 gigs, and PS3 games are going to be 50 gigs. Wait. Saying? Basically, Nintendo doesn't realize that the games are getting redundant. Nintendo's constantly always striving to change stuff, add new stuff. Nintendo's what made the games better. They're Mario, not just graphics. Mario 64 changed platforming. Every platforming game that exists now is basically Mario 64 with the basic idea. Nintendo came out with the, with the joystick, with the, the analog stick, and the rumble pack. Now who has it? PlayStation has incorporated that control. Everyone thinks that Sony did it. No. What? what pisses me off the most, like Nintendo's always changing. Nintendo asked Capcom to make five games exclusive for Nintendo, mm -hmm. doing something different that no one else would do because no one else refuses. You know, Nintendo's like, hey, make a side scroller. We do a joke. So he's like, oh, can we get it, please? Can we and they, they go it over to freaking PS2, Resident Evil 4. Sony's like, can we get it? Can we get it? Down they, the they, they're crying. They want it. It's not about Nintendo's the money. Nintendo's that all about smart kids. I love being here. I gotta go home and get ready for work. I think that's the it? Button. Calling someone's mom a Windows file server is wrong. <laughs> what? <laughs> Max Shall we call Frankie? Alright, I'm gonna load up iTunes. Listen to some music that they gave us. 